haven't been invited anywhere for weeks. What's wrong with me anyway? What's wrong, Helen? Maybe it's your breath. Yes, you're watching It's Not That Late. We're actually live tonight, I think. Um, <clears throat> January 19th, if you're watching live. Danny's not here, but he's been replaced by S Sagebrush. <laughs> Hi, I'm not Danny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And uh, we have a full house. There is uh, a whole scary people. people behind us. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, Westside Players is going to be performing the Mouse Trap soon. Yes. February. Someday in February. <laughs> um, Imminently. Yeah. Sorry, I'm still trying to work on mic levels and everything, too. And I forgot to shut that down. There we go. So, uh, yes, West Side Players are going to be performing Mousetrap. These two are in it. We've got character names. Mr. P. Mr. P. Mr. P. P. Paravicini. Uh, <laughs> Paravicini. I asked earlier, and now I just want to say good day again. Kingsworth? <laughs> Casewell. Casewell. Mrs. Goodbar. Mrs. Goodbar. Yeah. Goodbar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we'll get it eventually. <clears throat> yeah. Casewell, that's, that's right. right. Yes. Miss Casewell. And uh, they're both going to be in it, right? Correct. That's Hopefully. not like part of the twist is you know, for Danny, <laughs> yeah. that you're going to be in it? No, well, I hope we are. We put in a lot of work for <laughs> not right. being in it. <laughs> yeah, I hope you guys are in it as well, otherwise you tricked us. <laughs> oh, uh -oh. Okay. Still trying to figure out where everything is. Okay, anyway. So, uh, what's the plot of the mousetrap? Well, like uh, Agatha Christie is, of course, a great mystery writer who has written many, many. In this particular instance, it all uh, takes place in uh, Monkswell Manor Guest House, <laughs> which is a new facility uh, as far as the people who are running it. And there's a huge storm, and everybody's cut off from civilization. And, of course, in any mystery, uh, so is it's it, a murder. Is it, uh, it kind of like the Hateful Eight? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sounds like the Hateful Eight and the Shining. Yeah, that's the yeah. Storm, yeah. people yeah. together, yeah. Well, yeah. mystery ensues. Maybe this is the Shining with more, more people. Yeah, yeah. with more people. <laughs> yeah, well, I would hope so. You guys are pretty much the entire cast for The Shining. Mm. <laughs> Just Jerry and I. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, what Here, <laughs> Johnny. <laughs> is it like six people are in the house? or Six. Uh, is it six? Okay. Is it? Six, six counting. To count them. Counting. No, there's five yeah. men and three women. So, so that's eight. more than six. Eight. Eight. Yeah, it is. It's definitely at eight least six. <laughs> at, least, at least six, yeah. Plus two. That was close. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, I've never read Agatha Christie or, at all, or The Mouse Trap, obviously. Mm -hmm. I've never read Agatha Christie. So, uh, <laughs> is it good? Oh, yes. And it's as actually the show has been running now continuously in England for sixty years. Sixty years. Six Plus. Years. It's gotta be yeah. good then. Wow. Mm-hmm. I don't know anything that's run there's, sixty years. There's a yeah. the <laughs> same actors. Now they're getting a little old in the tooth. <laughs> <laughs> like me. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so were you with the original? <laughs> I, tried, I tried out, but I was I was a little too young. <laughs> a little bit. <clears throat> wow. Uh, I didn't. I didn't think it was that old. 
So, yeah, yeah. 1958 or it's like 63 years continuously. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I know that the original cast that st opened the show have all since passed away. So yeah. of course, but right. so it's, I think they're on their fourth. Um, <laughs> the fifth bed of a scene. Bed of a scene. the fifth. <laughs> Can I like Henry VIII? Yeah. 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 Well, we hope not. <laughs> Doctor Who. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. There you go. Constantly changing. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Anyway. Um, yeah. Fun. So, cool. uh, so you're not just biased saying it's good. It actually is a good story. It's worth coming and seeing. Yeah. Well, she's a she's a she's a very excellent author, and uh, this is a play that she developed and wrote, and it's a it's a good show. It really is. It wouldn't be still being in production 60 years later if there wasn't something to it. That's yeah, right. and you guys are doing hundreds of takes and doing scenes over and over, so it has to be at least tolerable if you're going to do it 700 <laughs> times, right? Well, hopefully. <laughs> if we get off book, we'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's As a matter of fact, if you, the, the, the scene you were showing or going to show, yeah. Yeah. we're uh, rehearsing and we're not off book yet, so we have the scripts in our hands mm -hmm. and we're we're Still actually we're blocking, uh -huh. we're blocking, and, and, and that's where the director says, "I want you over here, doing this, and I want you over here doing this." And no, no, not there, over here. And, no, no, I take my mind back over there. <laughs> Which is a lot of that. You so, guys, you guys just came from rehearsals, right? Or did you not rehearse? Uh, no, we didn't have rehearsal tonight. We had a uh, had the board board meeting for West Side Players was tonight, so they moved rehearsals. We we will be having them the rest of this week. Friday. It's getting close. January's almost. Well, close. yeah, we start. We open on the fifth, and it's every Friday, Saturday, all month of February. We do have a special matinee on Valentine's Day. Now, by matinee, well. do you actually mean um, earlier in the day, or is it going to be a regular time? The, the, you will have a, it'll, it'll be a breakfast menu uh, at eleven. The show starts at noon. Okay. Oh, wow. So I can yeah. still take a date to that mm -hmm. and still make it to Deadpool. Yeah, there you go. Exactly. Yeah. That's exactly why we did it. I was just thinking Bring your a double date, man. You take a date in the morning and breakfast and then go in the afternoon and take a different date. Yeah. Hey, oh, you... wonderful. We are all about that. In the spirit of trapping and mouse trap and stuff like that. There you go. <laughs> um, I, yeah. Yeah, uh, really the most I know about Agatha Christie was really, not really the most I know, but uh, there was the Doctor Who episode with Agatha Christie. You guys watch Doctor Who? No. Yeah. I watched you might be a little the original. Of it. I watched yeah. the original sorry, Doctor sorry. Who, but that was <laughs> really yeah, good classic. for your time. I remember the first yeah. Doctor. He was cool. <laughs> yeah. I remember when he stole the TARDIS. I lost yeah. track of it when they went to color. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, there was the uh, there was there was you know, an James Bond. <laughs> there there was an episode where uh, they go back and Agatha Christie and whatnot, and it's actually very mousetrap ish mm -hmm. from what I can tell from the show, where they're all in a house trying to do a whodunit. Kind of mm -hmm. thing. You know, it's it's pretty cool. You know, there's a mystery about Agatha herself. Yeah, where she, that was, uh, the where she disappeared for three days. Yeah. Or and that's what they tackled. Yeah, about. was that what they were talking? That's about? That's what they explain in the Doctor yeah, Who. Yeah, so they're all about <laughs> sci-fi and trickery and stuff yeah. like that. Did so they have a? I didn't that. see that. Did they have a satisfactory explanation? I like, she never said. If, if you're a Doctor Who fan, it's, it's, <laughs> well, if you're a Doctor Who fan, you, you, you don't hate it. You can't hate yeah. it, even if it was crappier. Like, no, I love it. Yeah. David Tennant. <laughs> Tenth Doctor is the best. Anyway, yeah, there's. I mean, like you said, if if you're a Doctor Who fan, there is not a bad episode. <laughs> mm -hmm. They're all good. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, um, Skill. I, I, I I like the explanation. You know, so. Mm -hmm. You'll have to check it out. I will. What was it? I think it was season four of the new season. They, all they together, restarted man. it, you know. Now we're talking about Doctor Who. And, <laughs> you know, <laughs> the 80s, they stopped, and then they picked it back up in 2007 or whatever it was, mm -hmm. and they started back at season one, calling it season one, just so people didn't get too confused. Why are they starting with season... <laughs> what would it have even been? Yeah, yeah, yeah something. I think I four, know. that makes... No, no, because there were quite quite a few seasons back in the 60s, 70s. 80s. Oh, yeah. yeah so. Anyway. Yeah, but, uh, I don't know that. You and me. We can I don't know why. I check it out after that. we're done with rehearsal. <laughs> How could you guys not be coming up? Yeah, how is that? <laughs> it's been on TV for at least a while. Well, I've got a question. You know all the way back to 60 years ago when the mouse traps first started. Did you know <laughs> if Agatha Christie truly was the inspiration for the famous board game Mousetrap? I know it's a little more kid-friendly 
But is it based off of that? Oh. Mousetrap, mousetrap, no? No. No, okay. They just I'll, stole the name? I'll get rid no. of that silly notion then. No, no, <laughs> no. Uh, she didn't patent the name, unfortunately, and so oh. it was stolen. <laughs> so, so the game doesn't spoil it? No. No. Okay. no, 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 no. No secret clues. No, no spoilers. Cages aren't going to fall no, on top no. of people at all. Or no, no, no. like that. There's good. No, there's no cheese. Very good. Well, that clears up <laughs> no, no, there's a lot. Will they me. be serving cheese? <laughs> It's on the potatoes, here. maybe. Like, there could be I cheesy potatoes. I don't know what's going to be in the menu. There <laughs> could, could be a little, could be a little. Over regular cheese. I could look up the menu if you wanted. Because <laughs> if, if uh, anyone doesn't know about the West Side Players, it's actually dinner and a show. So you go early and you get the dinner, and then after dinner, the show starts. Do they take away your food before the show starts, or can you eat slowly? They do take it away. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. That's so sad. They, do yeah. they, they just don't want to. <laughs> be there in they time to ammunition. eat leisurely. No you guys don't want to be hit with, like, a <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, cheesy yeah. potatoes aren't so great. Mr. So P, you suck. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that would be bad. So I could, I could see them taking it away. Can you still have your drink? Yes. They do. They have and the open The bar's bar open the, yeah. the whole show. Mm -hmm. We just asked you not to get too pixelated. Please, thank you very much. <laughs> and it's catered from somewhere, right? Yes, it is. Okay. Yes, Who caters? Is it, is it, who's it catering then? Um, I just forgot. Is it Ruby Tuesdays? <laughs> yes, Ruby Tuesdays. Ruby Tuesdays. Oh, okay. Yeah. So the food's going to be good. Very good. Is, yeah. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think I... I heartily the, recommend it. I read Hard. on... I, maybe I should pull it up. I, I saw somewhere where, on the website there's... Is that like a new thing, the website? Because yes, it's a matter of fact, it's a brand new. It is, yeah. And they're doing online, so you can now get your tickets online. Did they get that working? Uh, uh, they'll have it up by this Friday. This oh, Friday. So not yet. So in time yeah. for the show. We're trying to join the. <laughs> you can. <laughs> Hopefully, trying to join the, the seventeenth century. Three days after the first show starts. <laughs> How come no one showed up? <laughs> Said they couldn't get tickets or something. Mm -hmm. I thought I saw a menu on the website. There is, yeah, I could pull it up. It's on my phone. I don't know if you want to pull it you up. could probably pull it up faster on your phone than I can yeah. on this stupid okay. Acer laptop. Yeah, we'll check it out. It's a race it's against a race. time now. Uh. I've clicked it three <laughs> times and it's not doing anything. <laughs> wait, wait. And the winner is. <laughs> Got it, got it, got it, got it. Got it. Just Hundred question start survey. Start <laughs> oh my okay. gosh. Yep. So the menu is sliced sirloin or Parmesan chicken pasta cheese. See. <laughs> got cheese. Garden. Got cheese and garden salad. Garlic mashed potatoes. Garlic cheese biscuits. Uh -huh. Garlic. And peach cobbler. Ooh, peach cobbler. Excellent. That sounds very good. I like peach mm -hmm. cobbler. Mm -hmm. And it's thirty dollars with dinner and the show, or yep. fifteen just for the show. Oh, that's good. Uh, students that's good. also have a discounted rate. Is, cards. I, I, is, is there, there a, is a phone that, number? Is there a just dinner rate, or do you have to pay for the show if you want the dinner? Ah. Uh, <laughs> 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 they put a wristband on you and the bouncers you kick you, you out. You can pay thirty dollars for dinner and, and I'll invite you to stay for the show. There you go. There you go. She cut you a deal. Like yeah. <laughs> you a deal. Um, we do have a phone <laughs> number <laughs> online, or you can call the warehouse at 234-2654. So 234-2654. Uh, what we'll do at this point is get back with you uh, and let you know that we've received your information and, and your, your reservation is taken care of until we get the online service operational. So for now, you go to the website, and it just tells you to call the number, right? Yep. Okay. You have an answering <laughs> machine, and someone will be in contact with you. <laughs> well, I think we're familiar with that. I've been answering phones for years. I can't think I can figure out to type in that. <laughs> we fight, we we're fighting over who gets to go answer the phone. I think I might I lose. I think you have yeah. tons of all <laughs> <laughs> So for now, tickets are a little complicated, but possible. They'll get easier supposedly by Friday. Well, you used to call the Raven's Nest who yes. helped us out for a long time. Um, she retired, and so it really is the same. You're still giving a, a number. We're taking the opportunity right. to, to modernize things. Yes. And <laughs> try to do it online. And unfortunately, it's taken us longer to get the service established than we anticipated. Mm -hmm. So please, folks, <laughs> be kind. We are trying to serve and take care of The process of yes. upgrading, which the mousetrap is old, and we're trying to make it <laughs> That's right. We're, we're doing a new version of the mousetrap. Yes. And holograms and everything. But the show takes place, of course, back in the 1940s during World War II. 
And so some of the So she won't be pulling her phone out. Yeah. No. No, 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 did you have a question? You uh, you dinner, murder, something? mystery. What are your guys' roles? Like, uh, what what do your characters do? Are you got either of you guys the main character or? Uh, this case file is a guest. Okay. All right. And would you like to explain how you came? To just be the there? just the first part. Like you don't even get into that. Just yeah, like the yeah. first fifteen minutes. Who's who? Well, that's what is fun about the mousetrap is there is. I mean, it's based a married couple opening <laughs> a shop, and then all of the characters really. There isn't much of a lead. I mean, we're all kind of oh. we're all kind of there, and it you totally don't really is know. Hateful eight. You spend it, about you forty-five go. minutes wondering who everyone is. Actually, that's stuff. what makes it really fun, that's though. And, and the characters great. really aren't what they appear to be. Um, Miss Casewell is um, strangely aloof and masculine and <laughs> odd. She's very odd. Mm. Um, Good character yeah. to play. Good character to play. Yeah. She lives overseas. Yeah. So who, who gets killed? We, well, we no, want you to come yeah. see the show <laughs> to find out who gets killed. But There's, I will guarantee you, <laughs> one, one already, character man. does not survive the first act. I would okay. think I would think that would be like part of the hook. Come see who killed. Figure out who so killed this person. It could be me. You can't tell us who, who got killed. It could be me. Well, the, the guy's there trying to figure out who did it while you're still alive. So it's, you, you <laughs> don't die. Yeah, yeah you that would die. be a good one. Oh. Or you could lead a false trail right now. You'd be like, definitely this person dies. In about 40 minutes of that character not dying, you'd be like, okay, <laughs> what's happening? Where's the real mystery? I will venture to guess that 15 minutes into the first act, you will know who's going to die. <laughs> oh, okay. We don't even get that. <laughs> Good foreshadowing. <laughs> Somebody <laughs> yeah. dies. Somebody dies. <laughs> Somebody definitely dies. Now, and it could be me. Or Jerry. It could, it could, it could be, Jerry be too. I don't think no, it is. She seems kind of eager uh, about possibly I, dying. I don't think it is. I'm going to show a clip where the inspector, oh, he's not an inspector, right? It, 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 no, is. Sergeant. 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 Oh. Sorry. I know it better. Oh. You do. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Or you've just watched that, that yeah, little I, I clip a lot that of times. Like five times today. <laughs> so, uh, um, so obviously, since he's asking you guys questions, you guys don't die, so you're safe. We survive. You, you make it through the first act. We okay. Do. How many two acts are you safe? Two. Two acts. Okay. For most theater, that is That's how it goes. So, yeah. what's Mr. P's story, and why did he kill whoever died? <laughs> We're on to you. <laughs> We're on to you. <laughs> <laughs> and why did you kill her? Why did that happen? Well, Mr. P's a Rolls Royce overturning a snowdrift. He's got a new place to go. He shows up and knocking on the door. <laughs> you got a room for me, yes? Mm. I've been watching TV for enough to know that the mystery guy that knocks on the door with his car broken down is definitely guilty. But see, my car also gets caught in a snowdrift, so. Yeah. So everybody's car gets caught in a snowdrift. And you (laughs) you need to understand there's no butler. There's no butler. So so it's not the butler. Oh, it's not the butler. The butler didn't do it. Are there any wrenches? (laughs) Is there a dining room where it could have happened? There's a fire poker. There. Oh. Fire poker, yeah. Fire poker's involved. Okay. Vindictive. I like it. Good one. Yeah, you're right. (laughs) And there is a dining room with a piano, a grand piano. (laughs) Pieces coming together, mm. figuring it out. <laughs> <laughs> so your character's just there too, caught in a snow drift, went inside. Yeah, knocked on the door. And they let him in. Where these are guests. Okay. The other characters are guests. Uh-huh. Besides from the two people who run the, couple the inn. Runs. Yes. So yeah. your character's unique. In a sense. Yes, the man of a mystery. He's the only one that doesn't mm-hmm. have to speak. Uh, British either in a British accent <laughs> oh, <laughs> and an English the accent. Italian, everyone else That's is true. He I gets to do whatever the heck he wants. Oh, you can, you just have to <laughs> he can change it. Every night, you, every night gypsy, you should change great. it to a different accent. You know, one, that, that one night Russian, Italian, I could do that. <laughs> then go Russian, then go Australian, <laughs> Spanish for a little while. You know. yeah. That'd be awesome. Pig Latin. You can even mix them like each sentence. Where's this guy from again? But I don't know. 
<laughs> Russian Pervasini doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> it, doesn't uh, right. it doesn't work. That might attract too much suspicion to you. They'd be like, I, I know that that doesn't match. <laughs> yeah. Why is that it's guy It's a lying? quick, easy fix every night. Every <laughs> night they just look at you when you start talking after hearing your name, and you'd be like, I'm adopted. <laughs> oh, yeah. 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 Boris Pervasini. I like that. <laughs> 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 Anyway, we do have a clip of uh, these two practicing from, Yikes. when did I show up there? The last, not last week, the week before, sometime. So the first remember. week of rehearsal then, yes. Yeah, uh, was. Uh, was that the first week of rehearsal? Yeah, I think That so. explains why you said <laughs> yeah. yeah. So we're blocking. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, so if I can actually get this, this DVD player is slowly dying. I am convinced of it. So it might take an hour to get it uh, actually doing what I want it to do. Technically classified as an artifact. Yeah. Wow. It's been w slightly well used over the years. Okay. So, uh, yeah, here we go. These two practicing. Enjoy. Mm. It's the power of a scene. Ah, I have told you. I was playing the piano in the drawing room. Uh, uh, to the inspector. I'm not an inspector, just a sergeant, Mr. Paravasini. Did anybody hear you playing the piano? I do not expect so. I was playing very softly, uh, one finger so. You were playing three blind mice. Yes, yes. that's so. Uh, yes. A very catchy little tune. It is how, shall I say it, um, it is a haunting little tune. Uh, don't you all agree? I think it's horrible. And yet it, uh, it runs in people's heads. Uh, someone whistled it, too. Whistled it? Where? I'm not sure. Perhaps in the front hall, or perhaps on the stair, perhaps even upstairs in the bedroom. Who was whistling three blind mice? Are you making this up, Mr. Perovacini? Oh, no, 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 Inspector. Oh, I beg your pardon, the Sergeant. I do not do things like that. Well, go on, you were playing the piano. Well, with the one the finger, so. And then I hear the radio playing very loud. Someone is sounding on it. He defended my ears. And after that, uh, suddenly I hear Mrs. Ralston scream. Mr. Ralston upstairs. Mr. Wren upstairs. Mr. Paravacini in the drawing room. Miss Casey. I was writing letters in the library. Could you hear what was going on in here? No, I didn't hear anything until Miss Ralston screamed. And what did you do then? I came in here. At once? Yes, I think so. So you say you were writing letters when you heard Mrs. Ralston scream? Yes. And you got up from the table hurriedly and came in here? Yes. Yet there doesn't seem to be any unfinished letter in the library on the writing desk. I brought it with me. <coughs> Dearest Jesse. Hmm. Uh, friend of yours, or...? Perhaps none of your damn business. <coughs> Perhaps not. You know, if I were to hear someone screaming blue murder when I was writing a letter, I don't believe I'd take the time to pick up my unfinished letter, fold it, and put it away before going and seeing what was the matter. You wouldn't? How interesting. Major Metcalf. Okay, I'm going to actually throw a train wreck into this because I'm not liking this. It actually says I was supposed to sit on a phone chair, but he's still there. No, that's the desk. Phone chair's Watch over by the Oh, whoops! Yeah. But, you know, I, 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 don't, I, I don't know why I had to go back there. I don't either. <laughs> you should go to the windows instead. That would make more sense. So uh, there you go. There's a little glimpse of uh, them practicing or rehearsing. Mm -hmm. I would say practicing, rehearsing uh, for the mouse trap. And uh, have you figured out the difference between a desk and a uh, phone chair yet? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. You have that figured out? I did. Okay. Yeah. Extensively researched I it. I did. <laughs> Trial and error. I, good, you good, know, good. I sat at different things, different nights, and I got it right. So. Mm -hmm. Well, the director said, "Now look." When we're doing the blocking, you need to do that's chair number one, that's chair number two, that's chair number three. And there's one chair that was over by the phone. And so finally somebody says, well, what chair is this? Chair four. It's the phone chair. It's, oh, <laughs> and yeah. I missed that memo because I had no idea what the phone chair I didn't get that email. I didn't get that email. I thought it was I really right. She, did. Did. she missed that memo. So she <laughs> 
<laughs> kind of an important one when you're supposed to sit in the yeah, yeah. chair, right? Yeah, yeah. You know where you need to sit. Darn. So, uh, speaking of director, uh, you know, how's, how's Travis as a director? Alan Travis yeah. is a sweetheart. He's excellent. He really is amazing. Okay. He's so well organized and yeah. Just, uh, yeah. just butter him up here. A little bit, but <laughs> yeah. fantastic. You hear that, Travis? <laughs> butter you up. It's a party. Go on, I'm going to mute your microphones. Mm -hmm. Okay, they're muted. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what do you yeah, so, what do you really think? <laughs> so, what do you really think? <laughs> yeah, I like it. You guys doing the whole the practice and everything like that, and then at the end, you're like, so what do you think? And I hate all of it. Like, you know what? You go here, you go there. <laughs> We're gonna try it again. That really well, is what makes it so much fun, yeah. though. But yeah, it seems mm -hmm. like it's all in good fun and mm -hmm. stuff like that. Good. I've good. been at this for a long time. I've had directors that were just <laughs> not to name anybody. <laughs> Almost as good as Travis. <laughs> just terrible. And if you weren't doing in what you were doing because you liked doing it and was and it, you wouldn't do that. You wouldn't work <laughs> for that person again ever. <laughs> and you're not getting paid for it. So. So how long have you done been? Well, I started with, uh, side with West Side players 30 years ago. 30 years nice. ago? I was four. <laughs> I was 10. Wait, three. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. 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 I no. Oh, okay. no. Try, no. Try, no. <laughs> Something about knowing 60 years ago, the beginning of the trap, 30 years ago, you being 10. I'm like, I'm, I, I don't have a lot to look yeah. forward to in the next six <laughs> yeah. years. You have to go down hard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, uh, so you've, I mean, how many shows have you done with the Westside players? I can't count them. Countless. I really, count. really have kept track. How about, how about you? Um, my first show was uh, fall of last year, and then I did three in a row. So this is my fourth. Oh, thanks. Nice. Nice. So quick. I jumped in both feet, but. Were you Dracula? It, I was. <laughs> <laughs> I was. <laughs> That's a good one. No, Dracula was the one show that I wasn't in it, or, or I never sang for my father, but it's a, it's a great warehouse. Oh. And what's so fun about community theater is you get people from all walks of life and all backgrounds mm -hmm. coming together to uh, sometimes make a fool out of yourself and, and well, you know, be in a, in a yeah. show. And yeah. it, so I've never met Jerry before, this, and it's, it's yeah. really cool. Probably that, wouldn't have. He's always active. I know, <laughs> I know. But it's, it's a neat opportunity, and they're always yeah. looking for people who are willing to come willing try it out. Willing to do that. Yeah. Talk on stage. Yeah. There's a talent. Um, some people can't do it. <laughs> I know I would suck at it. <laughs> well, it's because you have to emulate emotions. Yeah. And some people can't memorize the lines, and some people can memorize the lines, but when the lights go up, they freeze. Mm. Yeah. Joy Everything you just listed, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Every reason. I become I, a wreck, I, I crumple <laughs> under the pressure. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, so, so you've worked with a lot of directors over the last 30 years. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Um, by and large, the, the good ones, your actors are your tools. I mean, you don't want to dull your tool by being yeah. a jerk. Yeah. yeah. That, that doesn't help anything. So, so, you, so the, you've seen some pretty horrible directors. Yeah. Yeah, I've done a couple of bad shows myself. And so, <laughs> well, it happens. <laughs> You've been the bad. I've been the bad yeah, director. Yeah. Yeah, so. <laughs> so as of right now, you're not putting Travis in the bad director. No, no, he's in the good Is director. He, he's still, he's, yeah. Are you sure he's not still on the fence? No, he's, he's not definitely still, over the he's fence. Okay. He's, he's, side. he's over the fence. So it will be well directed. Um, well, it's being well directed. You know, that was, I guess, you said that was your first rehearsal? That, we that was the from? first week. That week. you were the getting there. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So uh, <laughs> it does get better than what you saw. Then. <laughs> please, <laughs> yes, please don't judge us. <laughs> there will be a lack of books, they won't bigger call, costumes, <laughs> no more monotone. stage presence. <laughs> yeah. Stage Except presence. you had that regal sitting on the couch pretty good. Thank you. I like how the dude on the left didn't have any lines as well. Like he <laughs> was acting the part, like the sergeant's questioning and stuff like that, and he's shifting uncomfortably. <laughs> What was I doing? I better get my backstory. He was right. looking very guilty. He there. was. He was. He did it, didn't he? Yeah. yeah. Right. He yeah. did it. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. No, so, uh, with so much acting experience behind you guys, you got Never Saying to My Father, Dracula, doing Mousetrap. But you now. didn't do those ones, right? Those are the ones I didn't do. But oh, the, I mean, I was just saying, there's there's a lot of there's a lot of shows going on yeah. all the time, and mm -hmm. Pocatello is actually really blessed to have so much. 
Oh, yeah. We have, we, we've got the old time actor studio, you've got West Side yeah. Players, you've got, which is now what, the Palace? Are yeah, calling it now? Mystique. 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 One of the classes I had uh, a few years ago, and I'm sitting there. And I'm like, "Wow, I have seen high school plays better than this." <laughs> well, I'm glad I missed out. <laughs> yeah, zing, <laughs> zing. They're not so unfortunate, but you know that shots happens. Fired. Mm. Shots fired. It, it was pretty painful to watch, and I mean, honestly, I had seen high school plays better, better. Mousetrap so, uh, won't be like that. No. Yeah. yeah, you will Mouse. enjoy yourself. We know John's real well, feelings you know, now. Tra Travis behind the wheel. Uh, I, I think you know. He's okay. It's going to be horrible. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. Travis is very talented. Yes, really he is. is. Mm. As an actor and a director, yeah, I've yeah. got to. He was in uh, the Passion of Dracula, which mm. is the one you missed. Travis was in that with myself. I played the, the butler. Aha! <laughs> uh -huh. And he killed everybody. as the butler. So. Jameson. <laughs> oh, we'll oh, he can never. See, so, yeah, that's the one Jameson thing that's not the in the mouse trap. There's no butler, so obviously the butler. The butler did, did not do it. Butler did Sad. not do it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Tossing cliches out the window. Um, I had a, I had something I wanted to say, and I totally spaced it after we got sidetracked. Well, it must have been very important. It was. Ooh, it's too early for a senior moment. <laughs> <laughs> it's not too late. It's not. It's not, it's not, not too late. late. It's, not that late. <laughs> it's not that late. It's not too late. It's not that late. Uh, everyone, everyone calls it it's not too late because that's the more common phrase. Oh, it's and, not that late. Yeah, it's not that late. Oh, I'm sorry. We, we went to Starbucks once and we we're like, hey, can you write it's not that late on the cup? And we got here and we're like, it, it, it's not too late. It's not too late. <laughs> <laughs> Darn. One job to do. And it's not that late. Sounds like more fun. You're like, ah, it's not that late. But it's not too late. Sounds like something you'd say to someone that just broke up with someone. Like, Dude, it's not. It's not too late. It's not too late. <laughs> not, if you have to say it's that, not. it's too late. Yeah. Oh yeah. And that's, yeah. And that's the irony. And you know, when we started the show years ago, it's not that late was a good title. Now it's like, I mean, and that, it even started at 10:30 at that time. Oh. And now we've slowly moved it back <laughs> further, and now it's at nine o'clock, and I'm still. Like, well, I should be in bed. Stuck true to the name. You, if you started at ten thirty and now you're playing at nine, it's it's logistically not that late. That that is true. <laughs> um, speaking of hours and whatnot, you said you think it start the dinner. Dinner uh, six. I, I believe six thirty is cocktails. Dinner Locked, at yep. seven. Seven. Show, show at eight. Eight. How long is the show run roughly? Two acts, two uh, about an hour and a half, an hour and forty-five minutes. You should be out of there. You should be out of there by oh. ten-ish. Yeah. Are they gonna right. be mad if I bring in a pillow and a blanket just in case? You could come join us. I mean, we have couches backstage oh, if you you're really tired. Can I watch from backstage? <laughs> Literally oh, rooms listen. full of furniture. Mm -hmm. If you stretch out in front of the stage with your pillow and your blanket, I'm you sure we can band. do a little trampoline <laughs> practice. Just hide in the band well. Yeah, just hang in that little front There's part. a couch on the stage. I'll just top up on there the There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, just wear, I'll, just, on you. I'll just wear, wear a uh, 1940s print and should be good. Right? Hopefully you'll enjoy the show enough you won't want to use that pillow. Yeah. Yeah. There really is a fantastic ending. I mean, it really yeah, is. Yeah, well, with the murder mystery, you, you know, got to tie it together. It's a pretty masterful whodunit, and it has a great ending, so it's yeah. it when, only picks up. When uh, I was talking to Travis about you guys coming on and doing something about it, he said, just don't give away the twist ending, and that's what happened. I'm like, ooh, there's a twist ending? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love twist endings. Mm -hmm. and <laughs> <laughs> if I was smart enough to read Agatha Christie back, you know, any time in the last, you know, well, you can still buy her books. Yeah, they're still around, man. <laughs> no, yeah. no, it's not too late. Amazon. Look, look, it's not too late. <laughs> <laughs> if I if I had read them in the past, then obviously the have twist ending would Hale probably Coop be spoiled. Have you ever but. watched Hale Coop Perot on television, BBS? No. Oh my God. <laughs> you animal. But uh, uh, see, and now I'm actually interested and want to know what happens. That I could go out and read the book, but then it would spoil the twist ending. 
Yes, you don't want to read it now. Well, yeah. I think it's the I classic book than the movie. Like, I mean, the book might be better, but I feel like a play would be a little bit more enthralling than a movie sometimes, like with that kind of thing, when you're putting literature to acting and stuff. So you could read the book and then go see how they do an interpretation of it. But then I already it. know the twist ending. If yeah. there's a twist ending, I want it to be so yeah, If it's a good do. twist you ending, you could see it at least twice and still yeah, yeah. enjoy go it. To the it's play. not like you're going to see it once and be, that's great, and then the second time you're like, no, it sucked. <laughs> go to the play and then get the book and see if we didn't screw the ending. Yeah. Or follow along. Or well, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know your line. Yeah, line. Wait a minute, that's not the right line. He definitely improved that one. He definitely, that's not what they said. That's not a bad idea. That would be a good one. That would be a good one. That's probably what Travis is going to so do. Travis is going to sit in the back. So that means that we could call line throughout even the performance. <laughs> line? line? Yeah, line. Line. Yeah. Page 67. I didn't do Sorry, it. Sorry, I'm yeah, just yeah. looking smart. It's actually Archie Comics. Yeah, here. yeah. <laughs> I got it hollowed out, my iPod's in. Yeah. The it's yeah. actually the the twist ending. Um, I don't know if we'll do it in our show, but on the West End in London, they actually forbid anyone from of, talking about of it. telling the ending yeah. after you see the show. So I hope we do something like that as well, because that is I mean that's how it is. They say don't don't, don't spoil it. Well, that's kind of cool. You can't. You, can, what, you, know. you can't. So, so no, you really. ca if you come cool. on, it's, it's like not that late kind of <laughs> tell the ending. Yeah. <laughs> Every hitman <laughs> following you all around. Yeah. 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 Travis is going to follow everyone around with that. Yeah, like a surveillance van is sitting out there scanning the crowd, listening to people, and you're like, oh, yeah, man, the ending's so cool, I haven't done it. <laughs> Do you know, I, uh, I hadn't seen that. I hadn't even read the show. I had, I didn't know anything about it. And I asked the cast as we were reading it. Uh, I said, "What happens? <laughs> tell me what happens." And no, <laughs> no one would tell me. So nope. that's good. That's yeah, good. I like go. that. I like I had that. To read it. <laughs> <laughs> that's cool. she had, she a had surprise. To through it. I had to play <laughs> <after> <laughs> it. See, I, I, I honestly think uh, two months ago everybody would have just been like, whatever. But. Star Wars kind of got everyone back into being quiet about movies mm. because everyone was so People encouraged yeah. to not, not say. say anything mm -hmm. about Star Wars. Have you guys seen Star Wars? Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. It, uh, oh, yeah. No, uh, I mean, <laughs> oh, you mean when the. The Force Awakens. <laughs> not the, the 1977 yeah. one. <laughs> when the thing happens, the thing with the thing. That's yeah. the best one. What's yeah. the better yeah. one? Yeah. Yeah. They remade it. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> Is Harrison Ford younger? He is. He looks exactly the same. <laughs> wow. He's my hero. <laughs> he looks about your age. <laughs> oh, poor guy. Jeez. Poor guy. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I, I, I still won't give any spoilers away for Star Wars, just in case. I actually still know at least one person who hasn't seen it yet. Uh, it's killing me because I'm it's like, <laughs> you've got the urge to just tell them. You yeah. need to find them. And they keep asking talk questions, about and I'm like, I, it's just like, know. you know, that. I'm like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. go see it. It's in the theater. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's in the theater. <laughs> yeah, I'm waiting for it to come on TV. And, you know, I, I'll, 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 see, I'll see you on Faith. <laughs> see you die hard. <laughs> die hard to the end. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you on What's Facebook. That? They like check in to the Carmike theaters. They're like, yes, they're going to see Star Wars. And then they post Alvin and Chipmunks. <laughs> really? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, think, uh, so I figure it's not on that's Netflix. That's a movie that needed watching. to be made. <laughs> that is true. Everything, everything worth watching is on Netflix. <laughs> mm -hmm. or, or Hulu. <laughs> I, don't, I don't do Hulu. You know, you I mean, should. There's a few it's got things, everything that doesn't have that's not on Netflix. There's a few things not on Netflix, but I'm 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 happy with what's on Netflix. I've Hulu. still got four shows I'm trying to catch up on on Netflix. <laughs> I am not happy with uh, like Friends and Scrubs. No, okay. Not being on, on Netflix. They're on Netflix, but you guys ever watch Friends or Scrubs? Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Unfortunately, you're too all old. Of you're it. too young. Friends. <laughs> 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 no, no. I remember okay. Friends. Friends. I remember yeah. Friends. I yeah. I haven't sat down and like binge watched Friends. Well, but you I should. Remember. It's good for you. It's good. Hey, but don't do it on and your arteries. What? See, I watched Friends DVDs. the original. Get the DVDs. Get the DVDs. Get the DVDs. When it was <laughs> brand new. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There's a. Uh, there's. He lived it. <laughs> 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 I lived it. I lived it. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> There's uh, the DVD, or, or on Netflix, there are so many jokes that they just cut out completely. Oh, really? And so the DVD versions are much better. <laughs> you know, really? Little tiny one-liners here and there, things that made the episode great. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm, oh, it's this episode, I can't wait because I know this one. And then it's not there. And, oh. yeah, it, so they did that with uh, Friends, and on um, Scrubs, they actually changed out a lot of the music. 
Oh, and, really? You know, a big part of Scrubs was the awesome soundtrack. Yeah. Because uh, uh, they were just amazing at picking the right music to go with the right scene and whatnot. They would do and entire episodes where 15 minutes of it was like music back yeah, to some I sort of I think I scrubbed dialogue. that one. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> Still fun. I like it. You should watch Scrubs. It's awesome. And, uh, yeah, when they when they put it on Netflix, I guess they couldn't get the rights to some of the music or something, and they switched out the songs, and it just totally kills the episode for me. So Aww. it makes me mad. So that's another one. Watch the DVD, not on Netflix. Anyway. First world problems. Well, it, it, it breaks yes. my heart. Yeah, it breaks my heart that such travities are allowed. Happening. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you know, you, you didn't see that with older things. Like, I'm sure, you know, any renditions of the mouse traps from back, from <laughs> back, when, sweet. back when Mr. P was a kid. They yeah, they're the not switching out soundtracks <laughs> because of copyright yeah. infringement back in 1945, did you say? <laughs> they didn't yeah. use any <laughs> random music. That they, <laughs> they had to write their own. Yeah. yeah. Can you imagine a theater they haven't changed the set in 60 years? I mean, I hope, hopefully they clean it. You, know, you, just, you sit down on the cobwebs, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> it works out for having, you know, uh, authentic props, right? <laughs> but I bet they got their chairs figured out, too. Like, one, two, three, <laughs> phone booth. Yeah. One of them's yeah. probably not They've called. They've been here for 60 years. How do you not know this? Like, they're the same place every take, time. It would be time to reupholster. <laughs> yeah, yes. It yeah, would be worn, very extremely <laughs> worn chair. out. <laughs> Do you think a modern, modernized version of the mousetrap would be any interesting? Uh -huh. Well, I they, think they with they the right have, director. Because they did like the Great Gatsby remake and stuff like that, and it still had tones of, of the era that they did it in. But well, they've done strange. several of her shows, uh, mystery shows that are they modernized and cut them into, in the, into modern times. Mm -hmm. They're very effective. It's a rewrite situation because you have, have so many things that they're talking about that don't apply anymore. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. Who, who writes a letter, yeah. right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm a, a good what murder mystery is a good <laughs> murder mystery, so. I mean, it could be a text, though. You could say, yeah. I was texting. Yeah. And yeah. Would that be easier for what, you if it was, where oh, were you? I was just texting. Where were you in the <laughs> He grabs your happened. phone. Uh, <laughs> You know. Oh, texting. you were on Tinder. <laughs> uh, yeah. I, can, I can vouch for it. Here's the timestamp. Well, I noticed that you had time to finish your text, put it in the pocket, and then come in the room. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, yeah. Priorities. Yeah. Suspicious. I know what the murderer is. I got him on my phone. Yeah. <laughs> I took a picture right here. There's a Wi-Fi camera. Just check it yeah, out. It Gosh, let us yeah. go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> makes it much more difficult. Yeah. Back in the day, maybe, it was so maybe easy. Something, a modern remake wouldn't be so great because <laughs> it would be too easy to fix. Yeah. No yeah. Wi-Fi in the house. It'd have to be. No yeah. Wi-Fi. Yeah, you don't have to go between persons and grill them and write down notes. You're like, no, my webcam is just on. But they see, didn't know that it was on. The power could have gone out in the store. Oh. oh. Yeah, no Wi-Fi. That's a, well, we don't. We already oh, have another. They'll, we're still, getting have, rid of, they'll still have 4G. Yeah, well, we're getting rid of cliches as well. That's like not having the butler that killed no. You can't just have lights go off and then, like, Someone's like, oh, great, this is excellent. Just waiting for my opportunity for the lights to randomly go off. I'm beginning to think you couldn't modernize that at all. Let's keep it in the 1940s. Yeah, we'll it in the 1940s. It so, and it's fun to play in different eras, too. Yeah. <laughs> I bet the outfits are pretty cool. I bet you get to wear a nice... Yeah, we didn't get to see any costumes suit. there. I mean, are the costumes... Oh, they have pretty... a very nice Italian silk suit, yes, with their longer pointed toe shoes <laughs> and a nice uh, derby hat and uh, a suit. Case metal one. <laughs> Jackie Serpinski costumes the shows and she's amazing at it. She's, Jackie's very good. She's yeah. our wardrobe. Casewell gets to wear a dude's suit. I wear a man's suit in the beginning. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. That's fun. Yeah. It's fun. Like at night. So, what does a 1940s man's suit look like? Is it 30s or 40s? 40s. 40s. Uh, like a suit. I mean, I've never worn a suit, so I couldn't tell you the difference between. Mm -hmm. It's empowering. It's <laughs> civil, it, wide shoulders. Like kind of a civil type suit. I mean, like. you know, basically the typical suit, as far as I can think back, and I'm thinking back to pictures that I've seen of 50s, 50s, 60s, men's suits never really change much. 50s men's suits were browns, blacks. 
their brown Maybe stripes tans. now. Mine's, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Mine is blue. Like, I own, I back in the suit. 40s, they were pinstripes. Yeah. Well, and I mean, then they went back to you know, stripes. Fabric, uh, color, and all that. Uh, uh, yeah, that, that changes. But overall, it's jacket, pants, button-up shirt. Well, yeah, you know, like the tuxedo you know? has been around forever. And they said we massively changed the tuxedo when they took the cummerbund down a quarter of an inch. <laughs> Drastic changes, <coughs> revolutions of an era. <laughs> but women's formal clothes oh, changes yeah. twice a decade. So is that a win for the men there? We're like, hey, we like it. We stick with it. Well, we like looking <laughs> at things, but I think also the hassle of changing that much. If it was vice versa, like imagine if you had six suits and you couldn't go out into your significant other, you're like, I don't know, which one should I go with, brown or black? Plus they have changed. I mean, you could also hand me down the suits. You though. could. I remember when ankles I mean, were pretty taboo. <laughs> Couldn't show ankles. That was about the forties. And now, right? now really yeah. you don't have to wear yeah. anything. So yeah. it's you now you're remember? disappointed. Well, I do. I, I died on the toilet back in eighteen eighty eighteen hundreds. <laughs> I've been around for a while. Shouldn't, shouldn't have let that slip. <laughs> Okay, so so from somebody, uh, from somebody who was alive back then, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you are really hitting your age hard tonight. Yeah, <laughs> he started. What, <laughs> what are you, two hundred years old? <laughs> I was debating before the show: should we make fun of his age? Yeah. And then he opened it okay, up. Okay, okay, I remember, I remember you, Eisenhower. Okay, wow. <laughs> yeah, you really, you really opened the really I like Ike. I like Ike. I like Ike. <laughs> what was the potato famine like? <laughs> yeah. Yes. What color were the dinosaurs? Strangely <laughs> enough, my family moved over from Ireland oh, really? during the potato famine. <laughs> moved, you hit a little moved home on to that Maine. One. Sorry, <laughs> I hit a little home on that one. My bad. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, wow. It's already. Uh, Oh. We've got like 13 minutes left of the show. So. Oh, we've yeah, got to leave any, now. Any, <laughs> I, I didn't realize the clock, so. <laughs> any, any final yeah. words? Any? Oh, please come and watch oh, the show. It, it'll, you'll have a lot of fun. With, uh, the cast is extraordinary. Very good actors. Well, is there anything the like The script, of course, is like <laughs> Christy. You can't ask for better. We have a superb director. And, of course, the venue is the warehouse. Which is always None fun. better. Mm -hmm. yes. It really is. If you, if, you've cool come, if you haven't come to West Side Players, You'll come and then you'll want to buy season tickets. I mean, it really is such a fun venue, and mm -hmm. yeah. as well it's as their thirtieth anniversary, so they're doing fantastic shows this year. So it's years. what? What other shows? Do, uh, do have, is it laid out? Do they know which other shows they're doing? It this is, week? yeah, for the whole year. How many do they do a year? Three, four, four. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So, what are the other upcoming shows going to be? Moon over Buffalo is the one of them. Um, Never heard of it. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> I knew two. them all. I know Moon Over Buffalo because I did Moon, moon Over Buffalo before, and I want to try out to do it again. <laughs> they will have it all listed, of mm -hmm. course, when you're there. Um, and, and yeah. You know. They rotate. They West Side Players won't do another show until at least 10 years past. So if, if, you know if they're doing Moon Over Buffalo, and we did it before, at, at least 10 years ago. And trust me, it was longer than that. <laughs> yeah. It's been a while since there's been a Moon Over Buffalo. Right? It'll be a good reprise year. It's and well, really they neat. did uh, this show. Yeah, the match chapter. So what was the, the first show they ever, that's what they should have done the first one. They should have done the first show ever performed at the warehouse. I, the first again. show I was in, uh, at the warehouse? The first show cool. at the warehouse? Yeah. The first show that was ever performed there, that's what they should have done for yeah, the 30th anniversary. Yeah, for a 30 year anniversary. anniversary, that would be really cool. Bring it back home and stuff like that. There you go. Maybe it was a really mark. bad show. No, <laughs> yeah, maybe they don't want to remember that. They I don't was in it. I was <laughs> the very in it. first show. <laughs> no, it should have been uh, Dynamite then. It was, yeah. <laughs> it was a great <laughs> show. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's like the one time we tried to do Phantom of the Opera and someone had a chandelier fall on him. <laughs> oh, bad luck. Sorry. So much for the fans. <laughs> so you can buy season tickets. You can pre-buy yes. all the shows. Yes, the, you can. And there's no specific date, or do you have to set up a date later when you buy season tickets? Or Well, they they're, they're available now. Of course, you'd want to buy them before the first show, because otherwise you're paying for more money than you need to pay, because you're 
you get a discount. The show with already, yeah. So. Yeah. Yeah. But, well, I mean, for the upcoming dates. I believe they actually call. I, if I understood right, I heard Travis said that he was that they were calling the season ticket holders and asking what seats they wanted okay. yep. um, and, and what days. days. Okay. 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 Um, so you don't have to pick it now and mm -hmm. put it in your calendar and then. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can't make it. No, yeah. no, no. The tickets are for the show. You can pick your mm -hmm. dates okay. at another time. Okay. So that, that's nice. Excellent. And uh, is it always Ruby Tuesdays that it uh, It is. Cares, it is or? for now. For this season. For, now. for this for season. season. Yeah. We don't, we don't say that there's going to be a certain person okay. for a long time because we can like change. Oh. I'm afraid of commitment as well. Stick with the same <laughs> one all year, rotate through different places, you know, but... Sticking with what's good is good. Mm -hmm. right. What's yeah. good, we stay with. Yeah, I yeah. mean, if, if they do a good job. If I were to buy a ticket, and you're like, oh, McDonald's is catering this one. <laughs> <laughs> Great. And yeah, the tickets great. went up, actually, really unfortunately. <laughs> They're now 40. Oh, <laughs> sorry. You should see the Big Mac they've got for this show. Yeah. <laughs> it's huge. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, that, yeah. <clears throat> anyway, so uh, February 5th through the 27th, is that right? Correct. Mm -hmm. Mousetrap, $15 tickets for just the show, 30 for if dinner you want and the show. dinner and the show. Mm -hmm. yes. Dinner's going to be awesome because it's from ruby tuesdays and i can't remember what, what, steak no do you want me to read it again cocktails at 6 30. <laughs> i can find it before you no. um, there was there garlic were, and garlic i remember parmesan, You'll have two parmesan. Cheese. parmesan. Cheese. there was cheese <laughs> steaks garlic potatoes salad salad i just remember the pizza. delicious cobbler. food they've got food. i was sold at peach what cobbler. more could you ask for <laughs> so. saltines that sounds Call good. and get your reservations. You can get tickets at the show at the at the door, but if you get there and there are no seats, what sorry. do you have to do? Then you have to yeah. come back the next night. Yeah. And then <laughs> if the same thing happens the next night, and if the same, maybe yeah. eventually then you, you should, learn, just call. Yeah, then you should change your ways. <laughs> and the you number, the show four nights in a row. And the number was... Dial information at... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Ready? Star 69. Uh, oh. <laughs> two, three, four. Can you connect me to the... Where? Two, six, five, four. Okay, two, three, four, two, six, five, four. Two, three, four, two, six, five, four. That is the number you can call if you want to get tickets. And it's going to be an awesome show. It because, should be. I mean, if anything, at least these two will keep it entertaining. Yeah. If they've managed to keep this yeah. horrible, sucky yeah. show entertaining for if, 52 minutes. If this is any sample of the talent, the show, the show should be very enjoyable. Yeah. So oh, let's, geez. let's see your tap dance. I, I do Ooh. tap dance in it. Really? And I sing a Can you give us an example of the tap dancing? <laughs> and, and how do you no, sneak? You have to come and see uh, it. How do you sneak tap dancing into a murder mystery? Like, I didn't do it. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what I did. <laughs> I like it. That's exactly what I did. Yeah, when you, get, when you get off scot free. It's quite a tap dance. <laughs> yeah, well, it is. I did it for your freedom. Was I didn't murder me? him. <laughs> the sergeant's like, well, I was kind of suspect, suspect, <laughs> suspectful of you before, but after seeing the tap dance, yeah, so you, you're off doubt. the hook. You can All go. All doubt is gone. Uh, let's go back to writing. We can your incorporate letter. that to Miss, Miss Casewell's character. <laughs> That's excellent. We'll have to we, talk to the director slacks, about we'll that. We'll put on a pair of top shoes. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh my. <laughs> That's the twist. She tap danced. Oh, that is. And it was all an accident. As that it gets more intense, I shuffle too, yeah. really. Yes. Yeah, that's I shuffle at really the very well. end. We turn into a musical. That's, <laughs> that's, that's excellent. Right. It turns into cats. Cats. <laughs> yeah. Cats. <laughs> Suddenly yeah. switch. Oh, my. Well, Jerry seemed memorated. <laughs> Oh, God. Mm -hmm. So, do your characters actually ever get to interact? Like, do you have lines that you two have to go against each other? Uh, sadly, no. You don't? No. Oh, I call Jerry a spiv. I call his character a spiv. What is that? <laughs> um, sounds like one of the words I, we're not allowed to say <laughs> on this show. <laughs> <laughs> it's a, it's a, a criminal. Uh, uh, yeah. I, I think he's spiv. She thinks so. I'm going to remember that. I think he's a crook. Uh, but that's like, that's like I think that's my only that's line. So you think he's a stereotypical American Italian yeah. from America? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. He's a ne'er do well. I think the show is worth coming to because of this guy. Ooh. He's it's so <laughs> good. I actually, as a character, have to be really. I'm kind of Solid. a downer, yeah. and I I sit and watch Jerry, and I'm like, 
They see you fight them. Oh, 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 like, oh, bury your head and oh, you don't laugh at him. <laughs> That'd be Dang my it. hardest part. I bust up all the time. I'd like, <laughs> 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 do that. <laughs> so, uh, uh, I was going to say, if you guys had lines against each other, you could give us a little preview. Yeah, you can give us a oh, sample. For no. So, in, no. instead, we'll just have to deal with how do you call him a spiv? Can we, can we hear that? Can, can just you just call like, him a spiv real quick? Can you call us, yeah. <laughs> Uh, Let's hear it. Yeah, what's the banter? I say... Oh, I should know that line. Yeah, you should. I? Yeah, you should. Where's the books? We need I the books. Say, They're going to have to delay the show an extra I week say, so somebody can learn their lines. <laughs> he, looks a, he looks a bit of a spiv to me. Mm. Makes his face up too rouge and powder. Disgusting. He must be quite old, too. That's my line against oh. Jerry. It must be. He yeah. tap dances out. A nice say. Uh, <laughs> he just tap dances away. He's like, well, if you That's say me. so. <laughs> <laughs> Perhaps I'm not as old as you think I am. Okay. That's good. I like this. Is that the twist ending? You're not really old? You're like, <laughs> no. You're like I cannot, I cannot, Benjamin Button. It is Benjamin Button. <laughs> I cannot say. You can't get anything out of these well, yeah, guys. Yeah, we're not. We're <laughs> it's, it's harsh. <laughs> so I guess we will have to go watch the show if we actually want to know anything about it because we so, didn't get much here. Yeah, we didn't get much. We know that someone dies and somebody gets house. called and somebody gets called to spiff and someone gets called and there may or may not be tap dancing. Yeah, may or may not. I wish the last part were true, but <laughs> unfortunately, that's the twist ending. <laughs> so there is tap dancing. <laughs> <laughs> just, just around the lines. <laughs> just around the lines, yeah. that's right. <laughs> Tiptoeing, tip dancing. <laughs> Excellent. Right. And you guys said that the also you can buy a season pass for all the shows, right? Yes. You can get a big old. Do you get a discount when you buy a season yes. pass? Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. well, I would imagine. Yes. Yes. What's the discount? discount? Like, how much is it to buy a season pass? Can't tell you right off the top of my head. Is it 100? Yeah, I think it's substantial. Definitely cheaper. Because what would it be if you were to do dinner in a show? Like, yeah, like it's a hundred dollars a for a like season pass. I think you're right. I think it's a hundred. I think three it's times four. <laughs> and season it's pass, nine. of course, is no. dinner and <laughs> dinner and a show for. I mean, for all four. So, so normally it'd be a hundred and twenty. So it's. Yeah. I, think it's it. I think it's one hundred. I think it's a hundred dollars. Yeah, hundred and yep. save you a few bucks. Yep. Get a few extra cocktails with your. Pass. There you go. Yeah. There you go. Good. Well, we're excited. Now, is Ruby Tuesday is also catering the. Do you make the other show? Because oh, you said there's the cocktails. The cocktails. Yeah, you guys, oh, cocktails? Or does uh, yes. yeah. Yeah. Okay. the warehouse have it? Okay, cool. Yeah, that's well, good. the warehouse doesn't own or have a liquor. That means I can get a Ruby Tuesday then. That didn't a local bar get in trouble recently because... Uh. <laughs> <laughs> So Ruby Tuesday will be catering at this time. Yeah, we're trying something else, uh, something new, something that won't get us in trouble. If you're the manager of Ruby Tuesday, watch these guys. <laughs> be careful, tread lightly. Anyway, so uh, do they do just uh, like beer and wine, or is it a full bar? It's a full bar. Full bar. Full bar. Yeah, really? absolutely. Nice. So. I'm gonna stick with the times and probably just have wine. I mean that's classy. Yeah, for that's yeah, theater. that's what I was hoping. Oh, some yeah. you gonna dress up? You, you put on your nineteen forty suit. And yeah, I think I still have it in the closet from when I was living in the eighteen hundreds. <laughs> you have a nineteen forty suit from when you were living in the eighteen hundreds. Yeah, well, we established that's when I was Skills. dying on he the toilet. A big sash. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> and mystical bags of suits, <laughs> browns and blacks. So you you dress up all nice and have your wine and stand there mm -hmm. and you know the women will look at you and go, who is that guy? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll clap for you. Meanwhile, well, I'll one. show up in we my one. I'll show up in my pajamas and have a Bud Light. There we go. They're there we go. And we'll make quite the tag team. <laughs> you can dress cash if you'd like. Yeah, quite the juxtaposition. There is a limit to that, however. <laughs> you do have to be covered. Covered, for the most part. man. <laughs> no, no ankles showing. And no ankles or elbows. Oh no, yeah, no, no clavicles. <laughs> um, probably you have to wear shoes, right? There's tap yeah. dancing, of course. Can't you don't want to get your toes stepped on. No, I mean, I guess you could take off your shoes if once you're in there. Yeah. But then you're like the an, person like next airplane, to you. Yeah. The well, it's like an airplane. Like you're technically not allowed, but as soon as you get your feet under the other person's <laughs> seat, you can just kind of kick them off. And <laughs> when was the last time the carpets were shampooed? <laughs> it's wooden floor. Oh. So never. Okay. 
<laughs> or it's, mop, it's mopped regularly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Movie theater style. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, surprisingly, we're actually almost out of time. I don't know how much time because I forgot to check how fast this clock was. So any second now, we could be going off the air. It's just um, turned 9.58. Just. Uh, according to your phone, yeah. not according <laughs> to the computer here. Oh. So, uh, Mousetrap, check it out. More information on their website, uh, westsideplayers.org. Org. Westsideplayers.org. Check it out. All that fun stuff. This will replace Saturday if somebody remembers to program it. <laughs> It'll probably also be online at some point. Check out our Facebook page, facebook.com backslash it's not that late. Uh, you can find links to watch it there. Any second now. Yeah. <laughs>